Hey guys, Avaxo here. Welcome back to the Gold Cooper career mode of Jacob Jacobson. Now, we've got some tough matches today. As you can see, we've got the FA Cup game against Newcastle United. We are the favourites because we're at home and we are above them in the table. So we've also got Arsenal and we've got Leicester away. So they might be difficult games. But before I get into those games, I would like to show you my sliders. So I'm always tweaking with my sliders. Um, the biggest changes would be the shot arrow going up for the users and the shot speed going down. Basically, just all the shooting will be changed a little bit. And I've also lowered our run frequency just down to 85 from 88. But I've kept the CPU user 88. The rest of the user sliders are the exact same. And for the CPUs, the biggest changes would be their shot speed going up a little bit to 15. I might even increase that even more depending on how good I am at saving shots. I've noticed there's a quite a big difference between like a goalkeeper under 80 rated and a goalkeeper like just over 80 rated. There's a huge difference. And besides that, really their marking's gone down by one and have a little bit more free flowing game. And that's it for my sliders. Let's get into the games. I've been playing a lot of goalkeeper career mode highlights with Jacob Jacobson on my second channel. So make sure to subscribe to my second channel of Axo Gaming. It is in the link in the description with the rest of my socials. Anyway, let's get into this match. This match is the biggest priority in this episode because I want to continue in the FA Cup because we're one of the strongest sides in the Premier League this season. Now, we've actually made a rare change in this game. We've got Matheson at right back. I think he might have played maybe one or two games previously. I wouldn't have started him. Anyways, let's get into the game. St. Maxim going down the wing. Early on, plays it into Isaac. Isaac, oh god, he's making a great run. He's actually crossed it. <laughs> he's, gee, I thought the guy had a tap in there. Great defending, just put him off. Actually, he's the one that made contact with the ball. Cross in, far post, good save, yes. Thankfully, our defender was there. St. Maximum, that was a good back heel. Oh no, he's got that for sure. He's got plays inside, will he shoot? Isaac, oh! We didn't make much contact there. Didn't really get anything on that. It was a shot I didn't expect to go that way. We just lightly just touched it to the side. <laughs> I was seriously expecting it to go the other side. I don't know how he's got it that way. Defender really should be stopping that whole side of the goal. Almiron. Do we parry that? No, we don't. Get, let's get back in goals. Look at this. We've got four players there. Pressure him. Shoot. Come on. There's so many players. Yes. Yes. Finally. Finally, we got the goal. It's a great finish clinical after we've just been playing around with it Willock that was a good one too a very good one too but Neves he's actually back in the in the defence for once and wins a ball Adama to Guaidas Guaidas to Mateus Nunes back to him yes is he on please be on it's a finish it's a goal yes Great attack. Superb. Can't keep up with us. Clinical finish. Who good? That looks quite weird with the goalkeeper. The cold breath is somehow behind his head. Quieters with the ball. Looks threatening. Look at this run. Oh, it's a good save. Shot was way too central, but still a good save. Isaac with the ball. Oh, great ball to St. Maxim. We're going to come out here. Ah, no. He's just wrapped the ball around us. I think it must have gone under our arm. I knew he didn't really have any players to his side, so he's going to take the shot on no matter what. That's why I tried closing the angle. Let's really see how close we got to this. We kept our arms too close to our body when we're going in. We're supposed to make ourselves look big when we're coming out. I don't know why. Jacob Jakes is hands so close to his body. I don't know, he's scared to get hit with a shot. <laughs> we make one mistake and we're at risk of getting subbed out. We've made a couple of saves and our manager just totally forgets about them. 
We're at risk getting subbed out. If they score here, we're, we're gone. We're gone as, oh God. Yes. I, there was a late reaction by me. That's a good save. That is not us coming off yet. 69th minute. They've whipped it in. Can we parry that? Oh, we haven't got it. Oh, no. Oh, no. What have we done? What have we done? I thought we could parry that. We're going to be goners now. Oh, that's, it's, it should be a typical save. It's only just outside of the 6 yard box and it's far post. Like, it, we should have enough time to getting that. Plus, we're pretty quick as a keeper as well. Don't know why my guy didn't jump and just grab it. Is that us coming off yet? Not yet. We've, we've put on ultra attacking. It's 2 all. Whoa, what a ball. Oh, oh, please be on. Ah, oh, he's off. Of course he's off. Neto. Oh, what a ball. Come on, finish that. Yes. That's such a great ball. And it's it's set up for him to hit the hit it with a volley as well. It was so perfect. Like, he didn't even need to take a first touch. It just, ball just sat up for him. Volley it, close post. Too good. Little jump volley. I love doing those. And now that's us coming off. What have we done? We made two saves. We had the five shots against us. One of them did go wide, I think. And the two goals against us. And we managed to keep the win after that goal. Good stuff, team. With us coming off last game, it has taken a big hit on our starting 11 spot. Yeah, only just starting. Jose Sa is right behind us. And we're 82 rated now. That's the only positive we got out of the last game. Going up to an 82 rated. But we got three more skill points and I added it to our positioning. Jesus and Odegaard were big, definitely their biggest threats. So we need Nevers to have a big game and probably drop a bit deeper like he did last game. Let's get into it. A dangerous free kick. We've got a chance here. Oh my god, Adama's gone up and he's got it. How is he so good at jumping? He wins these headers all the time. He's not even that tall. He wins them against center backs that are like six foot plus. How has he got that in? It's crossed in. Look, he's behind the defender. Like, I don't think he should be winning that. And all he really had to do is, is win that ball because the goalkeeper came out and he was behind him. It was a bad read from the goalkeeper. Smith Rowe back on the ball. Plays it into Odegaard. Odegaard's got space to shoot. He shoots. It's going to go far. I probably should have left it. It's going to go out for a, for a goal kick anyway. But we've got it in our hands. It's better to have it in our hands, actually. We find him. Plays the Smith row. Come on, can we pressure him to make him a mistake? Oh, it's a good ball. We'll win that. We'll just quickly grab that. Uh, we'll try to find a Dharma. See if our kicking's alright. Oh, God. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, he's done him. Oh, no. Try to... Oh, how has he found the bottom corner? Oh, God. I didn't want to just sit in my goals. I knew he was just going to keep coming. He was one and one against us. Tried... Closing a little bit of the angle down. I don't know how he's found the bottom corner there. Look at that. He's just shot it straight. Like, it's not even a curling effort. <laughs> and he's found the side netting. Too good of a shot. Fair play. Adama plays it. Yes. Yes, Adama. Adama too quick. Mateus Nunes. Look, look at the distance, the gap. Who good? I risk getting subbed out, it's red. Can we save this shot? Seriously thought he was gonna shoot then. Odegaard with it still. Plays out to Zinchenko. 
Oh, yes. Yes. Don't take us off now. Come on. We, we've got to save a corner now. I'm going to stay in the goals. I don't care how close it's to us. Save it. Stay in our goals. Ben White with the ball. Plays the Smith's row. We won it. Semedo. We might pass it back here. Arsenal were pressuring us, but we got out of it, and now Adama's through. He stayed on. Adama plays it into Guides. Adama! Ah! Oh, weak shot. Adama. Nevis. Good ball. Neto. Where the hell? What? How the hell does he score that? That ball looked like it was behind him. Somehow I'm getting around with that ball to be able to shoot that. What the hell? What? <laughs> like, yeah, he's shooting in an open net. He's just firing it with a volley. <laughs> Pretty crazy that he scored that. It's, it's like head height. Like, he could have just headed that. We're coming off now. What, why is this happening? We made two saves. I thought we were good now. We, we, our team scored a goal. I thought we were on good terms. That's two games in a row we're coming off. We only conceded the one goal. And it was a good goal. Jose Sarr on the field for one minute. Concedes a goal to Gabriel Jesus. That's good. <laughs> oh, wow. West Ham just accepted a 54 million bid from Arsenal for Declan Rice. Damn, maybe if Declan Rice was playing that game, maybe they would have won that game. We're now versus Leicester. We're up to seventh place now. We've got 37 points. Only one behind Arsenal now. And two points behind Liverpool. Leicester sitting in 10th spot with 30 points, and we can see that 9th spot have 35 points, so there's a 5 point gap there. Let's hope that stays like that and we can get a win against them. We've just let Vardy run. Run right to the corner flag. Daka on the ball now. Oh no, look at the space! He's gone for a power shot, that's how much space he thought he had. But we quickly close him down afterwards. Guaidas, yes, good ball. Matinho, one on one against the keeper. You got this. Go for an outside foot shot. Oh my god. Good run, Matinho. So even with the run frequency down a little, they still make so many runs from midfield. Keep the CPU's run frequency up a little bit so they can still make runs and, you know, make chances to score goals. Vardy with the ball. Vardy. I'm going to change the goalkeeper cam. Vardy's just. No one wants to put a challenge in for Vardy. Are you serious? We put, have to make a great save. Vardy on the ball. Well, I think he has, he's got to be offside. Come on. Come on, he's got to be offside. He's got to be offside, surely. He was miles behind the defenders. Like, ridiculously far away from the defenders. I, I've got to see who's putting him on side. He was so far behind them. Is that left? Is that our left back? Is that our Tory? See, so Perez is way offside, but he must be just on. Like, really, Semedo's just... I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. Uh, he doesn't even try to get back. And then, yeah, I get done. Oh no, Daka. Daka's so free. Have we, we've saved that. Yes. Let's go. I held triangle for a little bit just to close in the angle, but then I, I let it go and I tried to like make an actual save. Good one-twos. Very good one-twos. Setting up Mate Mateus Nunes. What is that though? <laughs> Why didn't he just shoot? Or at least play a better ball than that. That, that was shocking. Oh, Adama. Oh, my God. That's two-headed goals this episode. We don't get many goals from corners. Like, really at all. And But most of them do go short. For once, Adama's in that area. Usually, it's Matinho. Adama looks like a, a proper threat. Close post there. Their defender probably should have made a little bit more of a movement. <laughs> He's at the close post doing nothing. But what a header. 
Oh no, Tillemans. He's got someone there, but I think he's off. Yes. Literally, Vardy's like, oh, come on. Is that us coming off? Yeah, that's us coming off. Vardy was like their sole point of their every attack. Whenever he was on the ball, something happened. We made two saves. Yeah, we did concede that goal, but that was an all right performance. And we should hold this win. Unless Jose Sarr has something to do with it. <laughs> two more goals. Again, Jose Sarr literally concedes like all the time after coming on. It's a joke. Like a couple minutes on, and he concedes. It's an away win, so we definitely needed that. And well, Adama Traore with that headed goal gets in front of Kane. He's the top goal scorer right now. 18 goals in 23 matches. Just ridiculous. Just crazy. Ronaldo's up there as well. You've got a Bumiang still in there. Haaland in there too. Vardy, Jesus. So many great attackers, but Adama Traore is up in first place. And the assists, well, pff, we kind of dominate this. Quiders and Nevers, top assisters. And you got Adama Traore must have the most goals and assists in the league. Crazy stuff. And, well, we've got five clean sheets. It's not too bad. We could probably push to get the most clean sheets this season. But look, Jose Sarr's got three. Like, I don't know how they count that. Like, does it count who finishes the game, who starts the game, or do you have to play the full 90? Like, I, I don't know how they actually count that because you never see in real life goalkeepers being subbed off or not. Anyways, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll catch you guys later.